up guys and we'll continue from where we left or from last episode I think I'm supposed to go find the Sora temple or something so let's go some animals to f for my wolf because I think he's starving by now I should kill a rabbit but rabbit seems so nice so adorable Now makes it blurry for me to see. Azura has seen your coming, traveler. Oh yeah? Not curiosity, but fate that has led you. Azura has given me the gift of foresight. I had a vision of you walking up the steps to this altar. You just say that because you're talking to me now. You chosen to be her champion. I know it is unexpected, but do not worry. It will all unfold as she has predicted. You must go to a fortress endangered by water, yet untouched by it. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. She is the goddess of dawn and dusk. Azura sees into the twilight of the future and guides her followers through it. My people, the Dunmer, built it. We fled from Morrowind after Vardenfell erupted almost 200 years ago. Those of us who were faithful to Azura were given a vision that led us away from the island before the worst came. This shrine is our thanks to her, that none will forget that she watches over us all. Yes, there were others at first, but Azura's visions tested everyone's faith. One by one, they left, afraid to know their own future. But I refuse to abandon a shrine. The visions are a gift. Azura warns me of tragedy, war, death. Before it happens, I won't leave her guidance. Right, so I guess that's it. Alright, so where are we going now? Uh, we're gonna go here. Yes, we'll go there. We don't have to, we don't want to keep walking. It's a long walk. Mr. 
that. Um. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just shoot. <laughs> I think I just, I just shoot guy, and he was like, "Ow." <laughs> I'm gonna give all the guards the clock because they look really cold. How do you have it, most of it at least? Well, now where's the end? I need to find the end. 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 Is this the end here? I don't know what's the name of the end. I'm sorry, could you describe the smell? Yes. Like some horrible monster was turned inside out and then exploded. What did you do? It was a minor miscalculation. I've already corrected it for future experiments. This. This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. Come on in. Just soak the fire. Take a seat and if there's anything you need, just the mages are up in the college. You can ask them if they'll let you in. Then again, Nelikar might know. He's an old timer from the college, but he has a room here. It's nice to be out of the cold. That's right. College of Interval, just north of town. Hard to miss. Mm, can you please refill my drink? Of course. Until All next right. time. Where's that military guy? Uh. I don't feel my days at the college are long behind. Who sent you? Was it the college? The Yarrow? We agreed there would be no more questions. Oh, Azul. God, it's all finally coming back to haunt me. What do you know about soul gems? They are, except the gems always consumed. They're frail, except for one. Azul is star, a daydream artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Bar and then. If only we knew what he was really planning. Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying, diseased. He thought he could store his own soul inside, become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Illinois's deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star. But don't take it back to Azura. The danger are evil. They're the reason Mally went insane. I mentioned how the star is a soul. You can only store white souls in the star belonging to the lesser creatures. Azura's magic won't allow black souls to enter it. As a mortal, Mally's soul was black, so part of his work was breaking past Azura's rules. He was close before. Well, I already told you. So, all right, we're gonna take a. All right, guys, I'm gonna end my video here. All right, guys, I'm gonna end my video here. I'm gonna uh, take a nap and eat and drink. So the next time I'm back, or refresh and ready to go.